What's up, everybody? This is Carolina Mike, your host of SharePoint in 60 Seconds, where you can get the information you need in the first 60 seconds. If you want more, stick around for a step-by-step -step walkthrough. Today, we're going to show you how to play a video within the Hero Web part. It's awesome. Stick around. I'm a SharePoint expert. Play with data extra. Careful with my hands, because I got to use them forward. Yeah, I'm a big... Okay, let's get the timer. And this one's super easy. You're basically going to edit the web part and you're going to add a video to the web part. And when you add that video, it is going to actually play in the window. So we're going to change and we're going to go to the site and then we're going to go to videos, you know, SharePoint, stream on SharePoint. And we're going to go to this video here and we're going to select it. And then we have to republish. And we publish, and now we just push play, and boom, the video plays in this window. That is super slick. No more having to bounce out to a different window or all that. So let's pull back and take a look at what is going on here and why this is so cool. So let me close this video. First off, uh, I've been waiting on this for a few months. I I'm not sure exactly when it dropped to my tenant, but I had... Uh, seen a notification that we would soon be able to play videos inside the hero web part without having to leave this window and i kept waiting and waiting and i just kind of gave up and i tried it a couple of days ago and there we go i figured i had to make this video so yeah it's pretty straightforward it is the marrying of the hero web part with stream on sharepoint and if you're not familiar with stream on sharepoint just take everything you knew about stream on stream and kind of toss it to the side and now you're just going to save your videos on the SharePoint site where they should live. Uh, simplest thing that I've found is just go to site contents and just make yourself a folder, excuse me, a document library named videos and that's where your videos go or at least that's your starting point. There you go. So that is the long and short of it. Again, I'll walk you through and then we will release you into the wilderness where you shall spread the love and joy of SharePoint throughout the land. So here we go. Um, we're basically going to just edit the web part. We got to click a couple times, get here to edit, and then we're going to go and change whatever that is. And we're going to visit the site. We're going to look in our videos folder or wherever the file lives, wherever the video lives. I just need to let you know that it is not a folder. It is a document library there is a difference that's for another video and then you're going to select it and if you really want to get super fancy you can change from custom or color block to auto selected and it grabs a little snippet from your video you republish and then you are rocking and rolling there you go hope this helps remember do the very best you can with what you got and sharepoint rocks so do you take it easy y'all SharePoint expert, play with data extra. Careful with my hands, cause I gotta 